Hello, my name is Catherine Tucker and I'm standing for the General Synod. I've already had the privilege of being part of it for six years and I would welcome the chance to be able to stand again. I'm standing for the rural population and my husband and I farm on the Exmoor Hills. We have a 1500 uh, acre farm and keep Exmoor horn sheep and Devon cattle. And these are the views of the beautiful area that we live in. I'm also heavily involved with the local schools and I regularly help with the uh, assemblies and going in to hear the children read. They then go on to take church services with me, one in which we have recently done about sheep. I feel passionate that we need to bring the young people forward and to talk to them about Jesus in the church. I'm also a governor, I was a governor of the local school and now I'm a trustee of the West Somerset Academies Trust and I'm also an invigilator in the college. So I work in education with children whose ages range from four until 18 and I absolutely love it. traditional farmers but we are having to adapt to meet the ways of the modern world and the church is going to have to change too it's going to have to be attractive it's going to have to be welcoming and it's going to have to be able to adapt so that people will want to come change isn't easy for any of us but that's what I feel the church should be I want to stand for a church which is inclusive, inclusive of race, of colour and of sexuality. I want it to be diverse. I want it to accept women priests. I want it to support rural parishes and the way of life. I want it to be considerate of climate change. I want to be able to work with environmental groups to enable this. I want my church to be prayerful, I want it to be younger and I want it to be bolder, just as our lovely Archbishop of York said in his address at our recent General Synod. But most of all, I want the church to be attractive and welcoming to young people because they are our future, and without them, does our church have a future? 